And Kenya Power plans to use an estimated 10.5 billion shillings to meter all its transformers across the country. Speaking to Citizen Television during a one-on-one -on -one interview with our reporter Dennis Otieno, Kenya Power Acting Managing Director Rosemary Odwar said the move will be key in curbing rising electricity theft in the country. Utility firm Kenya Power has moved a step closer in establishing a system that will enable it to track electricity system loss through theft and transmission. We've started on, on, on a graded approach and metering of transformers is part of our, our vision going forward. We have done pilots and the pilots have proven to us that by metering the transformers and zeroing down on the losses at that transformer level, you are able then to tackle the losses better. The multi-billion shilling venture will see Kenya Power meter the close to 72,000 transformers it has across the country. The metering costs are also coming down. You know, technology gets cheaper with time, so we, we are balancing out as we move along. Right now, I think it is more than um, it's more than 100,000, actually about 150,000 to meter one transformer, so you can do the maths for all the transformers. Um, the costs are coming down with time. Technology uh, tends to come down uh, with costs as we move along. The exercise has already begun on a pilot basis in Nairobi, where cases of illegal connections are rampant before being rolled out to the rest of the country. So far we have, say, about uh, 50 or so transformers that are metered, but more on a pilot basis. Pilot has taken place mostly in Nairobi. Uh, we have uh, some places in, um, on Langata Road in, in, in the western side of Nairobi. We, we, we have a whole line that we took and metered uh, the transformers there, and we have some reports on the results of that metering and actually it gave us good results. And of course we will start in the highest gain areas and the highest gain areas will be the high population, the Nairobi's, the Mombasa's, the Kisumu's, Nakuru's. Those are the areas we would give focus initially as we then roll out to the other areas. Metered transformers will make it easy for Kenya Power to identify areas where losses are coming from as well as the beneficiaries. Electricity theft has pushed the farm system losses to over 23 percent, surpassing the allowable level of 14.9 percent. Going forward, with Kenya Power now back on its feet, the company says it will focus on revenue diversification, which includes internet sales, over and above its tight monitoring on technical and commercial losses. Denis Otieno, Citizen TV, Nairobi.